Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. It is Friday, September the 18th at 3.54 p.m. And apparently there has been some debate as to whether the Feast of Trumpets has actually started yet or not. Now, I my most recent email was sent to me by Patricia, who's dancing in the rain out there in Oregon. <laughs> Yeah, she sent me some real cute gifs of these little kids dancing in the rain. So cute. Anyway, um, yeah, this email came through at 1.41 p.m. about the Feast of Trumpets. The one before that was 1.18. And it says Feast of Trumpets has not been started. Okay, and I didn't look at that one yet. I'm just going with the last one. Okay, so according to Jerry Tony, um, here I'll let you listen a little bit. It's only three minutes, twenty five seconds. <laughs> Okay, here we go. We have uh, getting conflicting reports. Uh, some coming out of Israel, the uh, site that we rely on is stating that the new moon has not been sighted, while we have another source that says it has been. So has the feast day started? Well, uh, bottom line is, is I'm not 100% sure just yet. So uh, we'll give it a few hours, and I'll come back on and do a uh, look. Let me show you this. Uh, oh, this has 4,000. 888 views already. This is uh, Renewed.com. <laughs> Re I'm sorry. RenewedMoon.com. And they have been very reliable. So far as it is, and this is live, they are Hi, showing that it is the new moon is still pending. Okay? So they're showing pending. However... Um, I have this photo. Let me uh, go to the right one now. I have this photo that was sent to me by a friend on Facebook. Uh, when's the new moon dot com is showing the new moon was sighted and it shows witnesses down here. But I uh, don't know if those are members of the Sanhedrin or just people in Israel. So. We are, uh, in my personal opinion, uh, let me go back to this other one. Uh, we are still pending, in my opinion. Uh, we need a better confirmation that the feast day has started. But Okay, well, I'm going to stop it there, and I'll put the link in the description box. So, the Sanhedrin are saying, no, it hasn't started, and it's night over there now. So, they're like eight hours ahead of us. So, it's four o'clock. It's midnight. So, they should know by now. So, like he said, he's going to come on again in a few hours. But, if it's midnight. Oh, they probably know by now. And I just haven't... Um, let, me, let me do my own search. How about that? Has the... New moon been spotted in Israel. Let's try that. Okay, here is Feast of Trumpets began with the sighting of new moon. New moon sighting, ninth new moon report, no new moon sighting in Israel oh, a year ago. All right, this says... Okay, guys. This looks like a rabbi. <laughs> Friday, September 18th, 2020 at 7 p.m. New moon spotted now in eighth month. Okay. Like the headline or the title says, at 7 p.m. Israel time, uh, the moon was seen in the Galilee, which means 
Today is the first day of the eighth month, and I would say we're in the eighth month of the year of recompenses. And I'd like to remind you the way I'm seeing it is after the year of recompenses is over, which would be the first of the next. Okay, he's going to get into something else <laughs> about their rabbi, uh, Jewish, whatever. The year of recompenses. That's for them. The new moon has been spotted. According to this man on Israel Bible Prophecy News Analysis and Ezekiel Temple Watch. Okay, so about me and my references. This channel broadcasts from Israel in the Galilee. Moshe, me, is a member of the tribe of Levi. God's covenant with the Levites does not expire. Malachi 2.7 For the priest's lips should keep knowledge and they should seek the law at his mouth. For he is the messenger of the Lord of hosts. Jeremiah 33:19 And the word of the Lord came unto Jeremiah saying verse 20 Thus says the Lord If ye can break my covenant of the day and my covenant of the night and that there should not be day and night in their season Sorry my nose is itching 21 then may also my covenant be broken with David, my servant, that he should not have a son to reign upon his throne. And with the Levites, the priests, my ministers. Anyway, it goes on. Reading is making me short of breath. Huh. Anyway, I will link this one. And I would say the guy knows what he's talking about. I don't care Sanhedrin or not. He's Levite. It's the Feast of Trumpets. Do, do, do. If I had a shofar and knew how to blow it, I would blow it. Okay? So, maybe at the last trump we go. Those who are ready. Those who have been counted worthy to escape. All these things that are to come to pass and to stand before the Son of Man. Is it time for us to go outside of time? Maybe. Oh, I hope so. Maybe I'll see you soon. Bye for now, brothers and sisters in Christ. I'll talk to you later.